Hey guys, Thunder E here, and yes, I have a bunch of laptops in front of me. Last week, MSI um, showcased all their laptops for 2022 at CES, and we also got to check out their virtual event where MSI mentioned a ton of new announcements as well also laptops. Now, the laptop design for MSI is evolving. No longer do they produce bulky gaming laptops uh, like they did in the past. They now offer a wide range of laptop products that are defined with brand new chassis and diff for different audiences. So uh, laptops for gamers, content creators, business users, students, whatever you're looking for, MSI has that for you. Now, speaking of things you're looking for, MSI laptops are metal ready. Now, if you have an MSI laptop that's boasting a metal ready logo, it's equipped with an Intel Core i7 or above, as well as also an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 GPU or above. So these laptops are ready to give you the full metaverse experience that you're looking for. I have some engineering samples here. We've partnered with MSI to take a first look at some of these devices. I've got six laptops I really like. So I'm gonna start off with the very first one. This is the Raider GE76. Uh, this is the update to last year's uh, GE76. And honestly, this thing was one of my favorite laptops of last year best performance I got, and that's gonna be greatly improved. We've got a 12th gen Intel Core processor built in here, up to a Core i9, as well as up to a 3080 Ti with 16 gigabytes of VRAM DDR6. Uh, we do have, of course, a, a display that can go up to 4K, and we have that uh, SteelSeries keyboard, which is great. Uh, we also have that, Steel, that uh, RGB lighting all across this. Now, the cool thing about this is that you've got um, a max CPU and GPU output of 220 watts, uh, which is pretty good with MSI's Overboost technology. And with that performance boost, MSI has the brand new Phase Change Liquid Metal Pad that provides up to 10% performance boost, cooling your system down, and giving you the performance you need. And that is only available on the Core i9 variants. I really can't wait to test this out. Okay, next up is the Stealth uh, GS77. Now, I really like this because they have a brand new chassis for this, which is pretty nice. It's got this black color, uh, which also looks pretty good, and a brand new durable zinc alloy hinge, which allows for just comfortable work and play uh, moments, if you will. Uh, very solid all around. You've got your Steel Series keyboard, as you would expect. Plus, of course, it comes with a 12th gen Intel Core processor, up to a Core i9, as well as up to a 3080 Ti with 16 gigabytes of VRAM DDR6, which is great. Now, you've got all your plethora of ports. Now, this bad boy comes with six speakers as well, so giving you some really nice audio all the way through. It's a 17-inch uh, laptop. It's thin. It's light and comfortable. It's about 5.7 pounds. Honestly, feels a bit lighter in my mind. And uh, in terms of thermals and also cooling, you've also got that face change liquid metal pad, which will give you 10% performance boost with MSI over overclock uh, technology, which is great. Few things I really like with this that are added is, of course, the webcam lock button. You do have a full Ethernet port and all the ports you need from USB to Type C, as well as a fingerprint reader. I like it. I like the chassis change here, and I think a lot of people will. Next up is the Vector GP66. This is a 15 inch laptop, 15.6 inches actually, uh, that also has the brand new Intel 12th gen processor. You're looking at something that goes up to a Core i9. Now you have a display that can go up to 360 Hertz in terms of refresh rates, and your max performance CPU and GPU is 195 watts. Fantastic. Steel, key, steel series keyboard comes with this. You've got a plethora of ports. This is for someone who's looking for something that's a little bit more compact and easier to carry around. So Vector GP66 looks pretty cool. Next up, we have the Crosshair Rainbow Six Limited Edition. Now this of course is Rainbow Six Extraction and it comes with a plethora of accessories and cool additives with it. First off, you've got this really cool packaging box that uh, you, you get with this. You also comes with a mouse pad and of course your uh, 
custom mouse. Now, the design of this laptop is pretty nice. You've got nice detail of the yellow color from, of course, the game Rainbow Six itself. Uh, it kind of blends all the way through. I like the keyboard layout. You've got your AWSD keys, which are singled out with a nice uh, sort of like, you know, see-through uh, keys as well. And then in terms of performance here, we're looking at something that's a 15-inch display. Get up to an Intel 12th Gen uh, Core i7, as well as an RTX 3070 in terms of your GPU. Now, now this has been this is a tight collaboration with Ubisoft, so you're gonna see a lot of that blending within uh, this laptop, and there's also your gaming experience. And speaking of gaming experience, you're gonna get the most out of it because, of course, you can uh, max out the kind of performance you're getting from this laptop uh, with the unique cooling from uh, the uh, MSI Boost 5 technology. I like it. I like kind of the, you know, uh, specialized look of this. It's been a while since we've seen laptops like this. I'm glad MSI partnered with Ubisoft for something that gamers who like Rainbow Six or just looking for something a little bit different can actually go ahead and pick up. Uh, this is a fun looking laptop and uh, I'm excited. Next up, we have both the Creator Z16P and the Creator Z17. Both of these are for creators in mind like myself. I love it because it's got an aspect ratio of 16 by 10. More real estate for those timelines, more real estate for editing, which is great. Uh, refresh rate is 165 hertz. Now it's color accurate, 100% uh, DCI-P3, which is also good. And in terms of performance, you're looking at something that packs the Intel 12th gen processor up to a Core i9 for both this devices, as well as a 3080 Ti, 16 gigabytes of RAM, uh, DDR6. So all the performance you need packed in, you've got that Steel Series keyboard, you've got the uh, Dyna Audio. I like the speaker grill right across the very top of this device, and also all the kind of ports that you need, as well as also a fingerprint sensor. Now in terms of cooling, the devices have the brand new vapor chamber cooling system, which has a larger area for more airflow, which helps push performance up to 70%. These laptops are really great and they pack in a ton of features, especially for different functionalities. And that actually goes along well with MSI's new AI uh, technology. Now the AI technology is built into the MSI Center or at least your MSI Center Pro, depending on which laptop you're using, giving you some really great features like Smart Auto, which will actually detect what you're doing at the time and also will help with battery management, uh, power management and things like that. So you have a smooth uh, use of you know, your laptop. Now they also have the AI silent, uh, ambient silent AI, which allows uh, the combination of the dynamic balance of fan speed and surrounding noise to give you the best optimal performance of your device. So it's pretty good and it's, it's great, honestly. Now, my question to you guys is, which of these devices do you want me to cover first? Now, I can't do any coverage on them right now because of course these are engineering samples and the devices are not released yet. But once they do, let me know which you like. Is it the Radar GE76 or the Creator Series or even just that Crosshair 15 from uh, Rainbow Six? and MSI. So if you have any questions, any comments, let me know. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and always enjoy your entertainment. Entertainment.